Hi friends, this is Nageshwar. Welcome to my channel ITBird143. In this tutorial, I will show how to write down a program to print the current bill using structures in Turbo C++. As we know that structure is the collection of different data elements under a single structure name. In the example, it is showing the current bill including meter number, name, old reading, new reading and difference that is units consumed in this month and bill amount for the units consumed in this month. Now, I want to write a C program using structures to create this current bill. Open Turbo C++, type the keyword struct and followed by the structure name. Here, I'm preparing a program for current bill. So, I'm choosing the name current and after that, in the example, we have so many variables. These are called members. So we need to define these variables. Int meter number. And to define name, we have to use character. And select the string length. And integer old reading. New reading and integer difference that is number of units consumed in this month and float amount that is billing amount. Now, after defining the structure with its members, wide menu. Here we need to define a structure variable for initializing the defined members in the structure. Type the keyword and structure name. And here we need to define the structure variable. Here I'm choosing C as the structure variable and clear screen. Now we need to enter the user input, but before this, I want to show you a message to user about the user input. Printf, enter meter number, scanf, percentage d, and address of, type the structure variable and followed by the meter number. In structure variable, we have different elements, meter number, name, old reading, new reading, difference. So here I'm choosing meter number and after that for printing name, we have to type enter name and for user defined input scanf percentage yes and c dot name and to define the old reading scan f percentage d and C dot old reading and printf enter new reading scanf percentage d and address of C dot new reading and after that for finding the number of units consumed in this month type 
c dot difference equal to to find this we need to subtract old reading from the new reading so c dot new reading minus c dot old reading and after that To get the amount, we have different slots for finding the current bill amount. So I will use if number of units is less than or equal to 50. I will choose the billing amount as 75. This is normal building and if the rating is more than 50 then I will use if C difference is then are equal to 100 then building amount will be number of units multiplied by the unit cost it is I'm fixing 1 rupee 50 paisa below 100 units and if the unit is above the 100 units then I will fix one more slab if else if the billing amount is more than 200 units and below 300 units billing amount will be number of units multiplied by the rupees 50 paisa per unit else building amount will be see number of units multiplied by 3 rupees and after entering this slope now we need to print the Resulting values in the terminal. So for that, type printf. Similarly, for printing name. Result is yes. and printf old rating and for printing the new rating And after that, how to print the number of units consumed in this month. So for that, printf slash in and difference percentage d and for printing the billing amount, printf percentage.
percentage F and after that let C H and close the program let's compile this program and here it is showing 0 1 x and 0 errors now save this program let's run this program and here it is asking for enter meter number One, two, three, four, and name, sun name, and present rating is sorry, previous rating is three zero one two, and new rating is three one five six. And here I got the output as meter number one, two, three, four, and it belongs to sun name, and previous rating is three zero one two, and new rating is. 3156 and number of units consumed in this month is 144 and the billing amount will be 288 rupees so like this you can find the current bill using structures in turbo c++ i hope this video will help in your practice if you like this video please click on like button and please share this video with your friends and please visit my channel IT Board 143 to watch more latest updated videos. And don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you, friends. Have a nice day.